bulk package and side ticker. In this, we're going to do the another benchmark test comparison between all of these three Realme phones which are got right now. Starting with the first phone is the Realme GT Master Edition, which has got the Snapdragon 778G processor, and second is the Realme X2 Pro, which has got the Snapdragon 855 Plus chipset, and third is the Realme X1 Max, which has got the Dimensity 1200 chipset. Let's see how much another benchmark score we can actually expect between this all of these three Realme phones comparing side by side. That's what my main point of uh, comparing these phones and I'm gonna use the same Android version which is latest 9.1.7 in all the phones. Let me need to open the Android benchmark version and start running the Android benchmark test. So right now as you can see friends exactly all the phones are running the Android, Android benchmark application at this point and you can see the temperature is kind of pretty close. It's very very close between all the phones. There is no high temperature detected and my room temperature is also 30 degrees. It's pretty low. You can see. So at this moment there is no AC, there is no cooler in my room. Nothing at all. So temperatures are pretty equal between all the phones. There's nothing much huge difference regarding the temperatures between these three smartphones. Let's see how much difference from the Snapdragon 778G to the Snapdragon 855 Plus. How much we can actually expect in terms of the CPU and the GPU segment. These are the two things which I'll try to focus. And how these two phones will perform against the Realme X1 Max with the Dimensity 1200 chipset. So that's another uh, thing by thought of uh, making side by side comparison which you may have the clear idea what is going on here. So again, I'll be back after some time after continuously running the under benchmark test, then we can actually understand a little bit kind of more better. So finally friends, we got the under benchmark score between all of these three smartphones, Realme GT Master Edition and Realme X2 Pro and the Realme X1 Max device. And as you can clearly see the difference, 5 lakhs 30,000, 5 lakhs 67,000 and 6 lakhs 77,000 is there. In the Realme X1 Max device, you can see the overall difference in terms of the scores clearly. So 1 lakh difference is there between these two phones and between this Snapdragon 50, uh, 855 Plus and the 778G, it, there is not much difference, it's kind of close to 30 to 40,000 difference is there in between these both phones. That's another thing. You can definitely see here but the cpu is slightly higher in the realme gt master edition you can clear it's 1 lakh 60 000 you're getting in the cpu segment that's kind of really good score in the realme gt master edition which has got slightly kind of advantage in the realme x2 pro the gpu is 2 lakhs gpu is 1 lakh 54 000 gpu is 2 lakhs 41 000 in the realme x1 max device realme x1 max has got highest gpu sometimes as you can clearly see the difference so that's it friends, thank you for watching this video, it's a quick comparison between all of these three smartphones regarding the Android benchmark test results and in case if you have any other queries, let me know in the comment section below. Meanwhile, signing off. Bye.